pay less and get more. That's right. that's what's so great. Da, 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 da. Bose brings us that yes, because they, they bring us um, a better listening experience. This is a company that's been bringing us the best of the best in audio for over 50 years. Brett Hamilton is an expert in electronics, so we're excited mm. to learn from you today. I know stuff, but I don't know about an expert. Okay. <sighs> Should right. we count the number of hours you've done? Have you done 10,000 hours? Uh, I'm sure I have. Yes, you are an expert. <laughs> That's how that works. Exactly. All right, so this comes from Bose, and truly, um, this is a television sound system, which is basically essentially a sound bar, it's which a, will do what for us? Yeah, so raise your hand if you have a beautiful TV, but you can't hear it. Yeah, right? or understand it. Or understand it. I mean, the biggest pet peeve, I, I would say, and, and speaking for everybody here all at once, you get a TV, it looks great, but there's no room for the audio because it's so thin and it's so refined and it's a work of art and it hangs on your wall. So what do you do? When you watch a show, you can't hear it, you rewind it, you turn the volume up, you hit play, you turn the volume up again. All you're doing is making the problem louder. You're not solving the problem. So how do we fix that? Well, there's a couple different ways. One, you get a big surround sound system, spend thousands of dollars, punch holes in your wall, run a bunch of wires, get confused, get divorced because you fight over it while you're doing all that. <laughs> it's very dramatic. Or, <laughs> or, you can do this. So I'm going to show you the magic trick and then we're going to pull back the curtain and tell you how we did it. Because for the most part, most of you love the way your TV looks, but you hate the way it sounds. Tell me you don't hear the difference between the TV speakers and this. I have been here long enough for them to recognize me. I learned to ignore the whispers, the lingering voice. First glance, not so bad. Whoa. But that's a different story. I could carry out my work in peace. They knew not to ask questions. Listen to her voice and for the sound effects. And they're gone. The bottom end fell out. And it's difficult to hear what's going on now. So we enhance it. It's time again. It's hard to believe at first, but I got used to it. Back to the TV. Something's missing. Now back to Bose. Check this out. If you walk into a diner <laughs> and there's a lady wearing sunglasses oh. with a briefcase <laughs> handcuffed to her, what do you do? Ask her the end of that story. <laughs> no, you get, you get your food to go. <laughs> so the whole point of showing you that was not what you saw, but what you heard wow. or what you weren't hearing. Now you're standing here in the room that me, and you have never seen this in, in that's the Incredible. first thing you've seen that, right? That okay. was the, you know what? I mean, <laughs> so I own Bose, so I, I've enjoyed the Bose difference, mm -hmm. but that was Night and death. astonishing. I mean, yeah. you could hear every single detail and it was crisp and it was clean because I know for myself, when my speakers in my TV that I invested mm -hmm. in, that yeah. I hung on the wall, mm -hmm. when they point down, no good. I can hear it. I can't understand, understand it. it. Yeah, no, that's the best way to describe it right there. We're not talking about volume. And by the way, for those of you going, all he's doing is just turning the volume up. Actually, I had these calibrated to be about the same sound level as best I could between the TV and the Bose. The difference is, is that the Bose speaker is enhancing what you're listening to, where the TV speakers, to your point, in this television, they're at the bottom. I don't know why they fired down. Yeah, most and, TVs they are, right. it seems like. For bass, not a problem. Bass is supposed to reflect off of something. But the mid-range and the high end, which is where a lot of our voices are, gets muffled. And when it gets muffled, the first reaction is, I gotta hear it again, but I'm gonna turn it up. So when your husband keeps turning up the show and turning up the show and you're like, why, what is your problem? Well, it's not a problem for him or her. It, the problem is in here. Mm -hmm. So one cable, this is the best part of it. I told you I would show you how we do the magic trick. Okay. Unlike buying a surround sound system, and surround sound is three speakers in the front, two in the back, that's where the five comes from, and then the point one is the base, the subwoofer that you put on the floor, or you can get this. And on the back of this, there are two places to plug in the two plugs. This is the whole kit and caboodle right here. And it here. comes with all, everything comes we with see everything. here. Power plug goes in the wall like a blender or a dishwasher or a uh, hair dryer, or whatever. Yeah. Then you've got something called an optical cable. An optical is just a really fancy word for digital audio. Remember the red, the blue, or not the, the yep. red, the white, and the yellow we used to have with VCRs? Yes. The red and the white cables were your audio, the yellow was the video. This plugs in where it says optical right there. And believe it or not, on the back of your TV, if you have a TV from the last 15 or 20 years, there's an optical port back there. If you don't have optical, you can use the old RCA input. This will work on any television. You plug that in, and magically, this will take over 
So you're going to turn down the speakers on your TV and you're never going to turn them up again yeah. because you're going to use this piece right here. This is your new Bose remote and this will also control all of the elements that you may or may not have plugged into your TV. And you can barely see if you just push in there just a little bit, you'll see that it says cable, satellite, gaming system. And guess what? Bonus round, that right there in the middle is the symbol for Bluetooth. What is Bluetooth? Bluetooth is that wireless signal that connects a phone or a tablet or a computer. So now guess what? Not only are you getting a great TV speaker, mm -hmm. you're getting a Bose music speaker or an audio uh, speaker as well for podcast or, mm -hmm. or whatever else that you or listen to. Or if you want to listen to music just throughout your home, that's it. you just hook that up to your phone and then you have incredible ambiance in the home. You have free shipping and handling yep. on this. You have until January 31st of next year. So if you're giving this as a gift or you're um, getting it for your home, great maybe gift. you have family coming over and you want to be able to play holiday tunes. Maybe everybody's coming over to watch football on the weekends. Yep. Think about the Christmas that you will hear when those players actually catch the football or the helmets clink together, right? They're I, clinking. It's a little bit more than clinking. I was going to say, that's more than a clink. If you look up clink, two helmets smashing I, each other. I don't even are, know what it is, but I don't ever a want a helmet a clank. smashing into my head ever. I want to so, be very clear about that. Another side-by-side, -side, TV sound versus Bose sound. I'll shut up and let you hear. At least I could carry out my work in peace. They knew me not to ask questions. After five years in this one of my work, I learned to notice things. That's the TV speakers. When it gets quiet. Here comes Bose. Just like that, it's time again. It's hard to believe at first. You barely hear the pots and pans. You barely hear the dishes. But now you do. I understand. Right. Here we go. One finale. Wow. And that's any TV, by the way. It doesn't matter who makes the television. Yeah. As long as it has a place to plug that speaker in, and I guarantee you somewhere on the back it does, that's it. Is this you to hang mount. it on the wall? Yeah, if you, you want can, to. Okay. You can wall so, mount it, sure. Yeah, if you wanted to, here's, here's your, your mount. Yep. Accessibility. And then it comes with the plugs that you need. It comes with um, the, remote the remote control. All you need to do is get the batteries for the remote yep. to look in the junk drawer. Hey, speaking of the remote, mm -hmm. um, actually, I think the batteries may even come with it. The, uh, the remote has something on here which is really going to save the day. It's basically going to replicate what I just did here. Right down here, it looks like a thought bubble. This is the, uh, the dialogue button. So how many times have you been watching a show and there's explosions in the background and fire engines and all hex breaking loose? and you can't hear the actors, and you're like, I gotta rewind it and turn it up again. This helps to work almost like a, a compression, uh, an equalizer, and it takes all the audio and it brings it all to the same level so that you can understand and almost enhances the dialogue over top of the special effects. It's not gonna take the, the effects away, but even watching the news at night, the reporter's out in the street mm -hmm. and there's a, you know, a fire engine going behind, like, well, I don't know, what, the, what did they say, what did they say? This is the magic button that will save that. So mm -hmm. it's gonna sound good no matter what, but this will help to enhance it. You don't need that when you're listening to music. You want music to be the mix and the level that it, that it was recorded in, but when it comes to TV, it's a different story. You know, it's just gonna add to the enjoyment level oh, in your yeah. home so much. I mean, just to be able to watch a movie and say, what, what did they say, yeah. what did they say? Just to enjoy that movie and think about, you know, all of the, the family gatherings that we're going to be doing yep. now because people are coming over. Also, the batteries are included. They you are, are correct. So go. Bose do doesn't leave us hanging. No, they don't. This is a company that has been working on perfecting audio for over 50 years. And that's all they, they do. They don't do anything else. No, right. we were joking before we went on the air. They're not making washing machines yeah. and blenders and dishwashers. Well, because some stuff. electronics companies try to do it all, right? They do it all. They do but, it all. But they're in the Sistine Chapel and they're in Madison Square Garden and they're in cars and they're in homes and they're all over the world and bands go out on the road with their audio and stuff like that so if that's what they do and that's all they do that's a good sign to begin with and truly you're listening to the problem at home right now you're listening through our little microphones through your tv speakers but when you get this home i guarantee it's going to make a difference i gotta tell you too if you have saved up and you bought that tv that you just you know you love you yeah. mounted it on the wall let it perform in its best possible way by getting this home today. It's a small investment yeah. with the six easy payments of $33.33 to truly enjoy what you're watching and what you're hearing. E229, uh, E229-238. Um, alrighty, so.